皆さん、こんにちは。ヒゲさんです。今回は、つゆのキスつけど、愛してる、リアクションをします。As you guys may know or may not know, I recently did a reaction to ヒゲダンソング、White the Noise, which I believe is the intro to Tokyo Revengers. And I thought the song was an absolute banger. So I got me curious, what is the ending song? And we're gonna be checking that out today. チャンネル登録してね。行きましょう。Let's go! Very nice range. Really nice melodies. Oh, that's a nice piano. We like the stoic rhythm. Thank you for the solo. <laughs> I really enjoyed it. Pachi Pachi time. Oh, I really like the second pre chorus there. I really like this change. Slow transition. Bro, that song was fire. I really enjoyed that song. That song was just so good. I really enjoyed it. It's so catchy. I really love this song. It was so catchy. I really love the energy, the beats. I love the transitions, how it went from very fast and very slow. That was such a nice track. I really enjoyed that. But before I talk about the song, Kashi, you must show. So here we are to the lyrics to Kisutsu Kedo Ai Shiteru. And after looking at the lyrics, I can kind of tell that the song is talking about overcoming something, the wanting to protect something or someone.、Um, maybe the person in the video is not as strong,、um, but they are trying their best to perhaps maybe get stronger, protect somebody. Like I mentioned before, this song is the ending of an anime.、Um, you guys already knew that. But I think that's what the song is mostly talking about. But also, I kind of want to point out that I think these lyrics are also not properly translated. They seem very 
Google translation -y. But unfortunately, there wasn't any other English translations that I could find online. Regardless of that, I think that's what the song is talking about. Um, but if you guys know what the real meaning of the song, please let me know in the comment section. But with that being said, video, more than my show. And now for the song, I absolutely love the song. The vocals, I mean, man, she has some very strong pipes. The melodies in here are what really took me away. The, her vocals alongside with that piano, I mean, my god, that piano too, the piano playing, that, that was a masterful playing. I really like how the piano had so much energy all throughout the song. They were just pulling out those notes, like no tomorrow. I really enjoyed that. And then with the vocals, I really like how her voice has a very gentle nature to it, but yet still very strong. I know at times I heard a little bit of kind of like a whispering singing as well. Not a whispering singing, but whenever someone sings, they kind of have a little bit of a breath kind of effect after. I really enjoyed the use of that. And then before I forget the solo, the solo was also fantastic. I was not expecting the solo in the song. There wasn't really anything else besides the piano, synthesizers and the vocals so I wasn't really expecting the electric guitar to come out of nowhere I thought that was just really cool but overall the song was just a lot of fun I really enjoyed the melodies the piano was fantastic the solo as well the vocals I mean I want to listen to the song again because it's that catchy